Attention, the following video is going to totally kick ass. If you enjoy any of it and or have a large penis, please click the like button below. Enjoy. Hello everyone, I'm KR Speedy and welcome back to South Park The Stick of Truth. Um, I had a thought after last episode that the reason why we couldn't do the Jimmy quest is because we probably needed to bring out Jimmy while we were at the farm. So what I did, I just walked up to the farm here with Jimmy and my party and it immediately triggered a cutscene so I paused it so I could show it to you guys. So let's get to it. Oh boy, the cattle ranch. We're here. Excuse us. Hello. Hey, get off my ranch. Sorry to bother you, sir. We are elven warriors of the forest. <laughs> I understand you might have a, f a flute for sale. You want to buy the flute? It just so happens I'm a level 10 bard. And a flute is just what I need to play magical songs of enchantment. Of enchantment. Magical songs of enchantment. Oh, not this again. A flute is just what I need to play magical songs of enchantment. Let me skip it. A flute is just what I need to play magical songs of enchantment. Come on. Of enchantment. Magical songs of enchantment. Of enchantment. Come on, Jimmy. A flute is just what I need to play magical songs of enchantment. <laughs> Let me skip it. Magical songs of enchantment. Magical songs. Do I have to do it myself? All right, I'm just holding B myself then. Fuck it. It won't let me do it. Magical songs of enchantment. I can't skip this. A flute is just what I need to play. I'm holding in B, which usually allows you to uh, skip cutscenes. But in previous Jimmy parts, they've let me actually. It told me to press B. I'm hitting every button on my controller. Oh, he finally did it. Yeah, well, the only problem is the flute's in the barn, and there's where the crazy cattle are locked up. Damnedest thing I ever saw. Some of the cattle started acting real funny. I, I tried to calm them down, but they shouted something in German and, and then tried to kill me. Well, don't worry, sir. You just need the help from a level 10 bard and his warrior friend. Leave it to us. All right, if you say so. Here's the keys to the barn. Looks like we're going to be fighting some Nazi cows now, so I'm really excited for this. Um, This is the first time I'm going to fight alongside Jimmy, too. I have not used him as a buddy yet, so let's get to it. And then we will go get our picture taken at Photo Dojo and head up to Canada. All right, cows. It's time to stop misbehaving. Oh, my. Looks like we got a fight on our hands. That's a lot of cows. Your pain will be music to my ears. And none of my summon abilities are ready yet. 903 armor. Well, let's see what Mr. Katana is going to do for these guys. Ooh, that was pretty good. And I kind of messed up on it, too. Oh, wow, he just blew up over there. Power cord. What's this going to do? An amazing feat of skill. Ooh, we just increased our PP, so that was pointless since we already had full. Now, what is his abilities? Same as when we uh, battled him before, but let's do the brown note to make these cows shit themselves. Mash it. I can do that. Oh my god. I'm mashing. I've been mashing, actually, because I didn't know what I was doing. Oh, perfect. Set him up and knock him down. Damn right, Jimmy. Got any new material? Wow, that was a lot of damage. Did he just suicide bomb me? They're all suicide bombing. <laughs> yes. That's hilarious. Say encore? <laughs> oh, it's the most pointless battle ever. They just all suicide. I uh, retrieve the flute from the barn. That's my current objective. Let's get some cash here because we desperately need cash. After, uh, for some reason, deciding to spend all my money to look like David Hasselhoff for no in-game advantages except to have a bunch of chicks saying they want to do you. Looks like I need to knock this down to uh, trigger a farting thingy here. Yes, indeed. That's what I needed to do. Perfect. Ooh, that will give me the flute here. Perfect. Now, there's treasure back behind this here. Can I go underneath that? Yes, I can, actually. Sweet. Crossbow patch. What's this going to do? Deal 20% more bow damage. I'm actually using a strong bow, so if I can increase that by 20, that might be something I'm interested in. Let me look at that real quick. That is going to do a lot more than 100 gross damage, because 20% on something that does so much damage is much better. Let's return back to normal size here, and we will head over to this fella right here. Hey, you did it! You elves were pretty alright! Did you find the flute? I sure did, Rancher Bill. And now my bardic abilities will be greater than ever before. <laughs> well, you earned it. 
See you around. Thanks, new kid. I couldn't have done it without you. Where should we go next? Jimmy is now my friend. So it looks like that's all I really got from that is Jimmy to be my friend, unless it does increase his uh his abilities in battle. I'm gonna fight with him a few more times here because I haven't fought much with him before. And now we are heading over to Photo Dojo to find ourselves a new picture so that we can head north to Canada and ultimately get those documents from the clinic translated. We've arrived. Last time I was in here, I couldn't do anything. So obviously, now this building has a purpose. Hello, sir. Hi, here to get your passport photo taken? Just head into the room there and we'll get started. Sounds easy enough. Unless there's some Nazi zombies in here. Step between the lights, please. That's great. Okay, smile. Oh, do you have anything else you could wear? Could you try something else on? Keep current outfit. Yeah, it's just... It's just not working. Let's try that other outfit. Really? Uh, no. Tell you what, how about just no shirt at all? Let's try that. This guy is a pedophile, I bet. Yeah, that's gonna work better. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, those pants don't work with the lighting. Could you roll up your pants? Or, you know what? Just take take the pants off, too. Okay, that's good. Really nice. Yes, very nice. How about we lose the underwear? You sick son of a bitch! Stop him! You'll never take me alive! <laughs> I was not expecting this when I walked in there. How's everybody doing tonight? Good? Let's try out our new crossbow of impalement. Oh, uh, when you see that flash, hit X or Y to fart. Ah! Wow, that's a good bit of damage. I like my new weapons. Okay, and uh, for Jimmy, we will do... Let's do Song of Buffness. Don't forget to tip your serving winch. And now for my next trick. There once was a maiden from st 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 Stoneberry Hollow. I like how you mashed she A to help much, him sing. Boy, did she... Boy, did she <laughs> I had a nice lance that she set, set up her. The maiden from Stoneberry who is also your mom. Wow, what is with the Gordians? And all that does is just give me ability up. Oh, and it set hurts him, him and knocks him down. Me. Okay, cool. He taking pictures of us? And then he pukes? Does this guy even hurt us? Alright. Let's go. Uh, tell my wife I wasn't that into her. Did somebody say encore? <laughs> Oh, man. Wow, good job, kid. You're quite the fighter. Thank All you, right, sir. let's get this over with. Say cheese. But I still don't have any clothes Congrats, on. Congrats, kid. You have your first passport. Victory. And we got our new passport. Make your way to Canada's border. Oh, and apparently my makeover wig is still on me, but I can't see it. So that's always good. About 60% hair, 40% salon products. By the way, I got a uh, chin Pokemon out of Cartman's garage off camera. It's the only thing I did off camera, but I thought I'd let you guys know about it. And on that note, I actually have 18 of the 30 Chin Pokemon, and I know some of the ones I've missed, because I've obviously watched back my editing and stuff like that, and I see where I missed them, which is kind of sad. But hey, it's okay. Oh, look at this. I have not seen this before. Oh, cool! Oh, there's a kid up here. Well, wow, breaking and entering! That was awesome! Sweet, a free friend request. I like it. I hope I can destroy property someday. And now, with this probe, can we find anything cool over here? Yes, treasure. What do we got? Mana, snowflake patch, which is pretty out leveled at this point. A cool mana potion. And let's check the other side of this other building over here, too. And it won't let me go in that building. So, we are going to have to head back to the ground. So, on our map now, we are currently heading up to Canada. How you get there, I don't know, but I'm going to go through the farm and hope I figure it out. And I will see you guys whenever something interesting happens. So, I'm assuming we have to go this way. You can't get by them unless you hey, fart hey, on hey, them, hey. I think. Is that all you got, bruh? Yes. Here's the Enchanted Forest, I believe is what it's called. They say bad things happen here. I'm just going to head north, because that makes sense. Oh yeah, remember uh, Kyle gave me the directions on which way to go, and he said just go north, and then north, and then north again? Although there's probably a bunch of hidden stuff in here. I'm just gonna head left one time to see what happens. Hmm, I bet you're- 
I bet it's so easy to get lost in this place. I'm just gonna head north, stick to the story. Shut up, Cartman. I'm just gonna stick to the story and heading north, and then maybe another time we can come back and explore this, and maybe some of the other things we miss after the main story of this game. Let's head north again. And north again. Missed. Um. I'm just gonna fight this guy to get some experience. I'll see you guys afterwards. That does 8,000 damage now, and he had 900 armor on. That is amazing. I just want to do this one more time here. Let's do it with a fart attack. Can I even do more than 9,000 damage? Game over at this point. I'm that guy in Pokemon, and even if you don't have to battle someone, I battle them anyway to make my team stronger. Let's go up. Ooh, we're at the border now, guys. Look at that. You can see it. This is the part of the world in which heads come off their body when they talk. Nope, you see? No matter which way you go, I block you. Ah, I see you have a passport. All right, hand it over. Papers appear to be in order. Very well. I hereby grant thee access to the great nation of Canada. Sweet. Open the gate. Oh, I'll do it. Hold on. <laughs> there we go. Oh, Canada. Let's go. <laughs> we got Ottawa, we got Winnipeg. Are you kidding me? This is so cool. And now we're loading ourselves in here. You're not from around here, are you? Canada is literally an RPG. This is hilarious. Stay here in town. Those direwolves can rip your anus apart in mere seconds. Just walks into someone's house. <laughs> they just keep going. <laughs> All right, let's check out this one. What's the sign say? Nothing. Okay, let's check out this. Welcome to the shop. Can I interest you in my wares? Is this just a regular shop here? Actually, you might have a cool weapon or something. Hmm, this weapon actually is less good than my katana, so I'm not going to be interested. But I appreciate it. So what about consumables? Do they have any weird stuff up here, like uh? We got a Tim Hortons or anything? Nope. Oh, look what I did. Canadian gemstone. Cool. Best stay here in town. Those direwolves can rip your anus apart in mere seconds. I might have already talked to him. I'm not sure. Will you talk to Ottawa me? Ottawa is the capital of all Canada. <laughs> all right. Welcome to the Ottawa Clinic. Are you here for an HIV test? I can heal you for five Canadian dollars. I think I'll pass. Still trying to get that money up. Come back whenever you need healing or another HIV test. <laughs> Oh, this is too much. I was not expecting this. Okay, what's this guy do? Welcome to the Bank of Canada. Well, exchange money. money. The current exchange rate is 1.24 to the dollar. All right, I'm actually going to exchange. Give 20 US. So now I have Canadian money too. All right. So I probably couldn't even got healing over there because I didn't have money yet. Ottawa is the capital Already of all Canada. Canada. So is there any hidden stuff here? I guess not. Doesn't look like I can go either way. Oh my god, this is quite the uh, massive adventure. The, the best part of the tour, or the candelabras, depending on what you're into. Sorry, guy, I'm on duty. Not your buddy, guy. All right, and it's a self-guided tour. You're gonna have to figure it out on your own. Let's talk to these two gentlemen. Oh hail the prince and princess of Canada! Hail, yeah! The audio tour is narrated by Brian Adams. <laughs> well, well, what have we here? A hero from the south? Not just anyone can pass the guard at the great border. You must have beaten the odds and obtained. A passport. I am the Prince of Canada, and this is my lovely wife. How can I help you? <laughs> What's this? Hmm. Sorry, but I don't know what this says. I've seen this language before, but I believe it's only spoken in a specific part of Canada. I suggest you travel west of here and seek out the Earl of Winnipeg. He can tell you where in Canada they speak this freakish tongue. <laughs> but I warn you, the wilderness of Canada is filled with dire wolves. You know what dire wolves are, right? They're like wolves, but they're dire. Oh my god. Ooh, we got a stuff to buy shirts Princess over here. Twice when she met you. That is a great honor. Hold it right there. Here are your photos with the prince and princess. Would you like two 8x10s or six 5x7s? <laughs> I'll take some 8x10s. All right, there you go. You can exit right through there. Now I'll take some 5x7s. 
what do we got here? Treasure and lower enemies attack on perfect strike. Eh, maybe. All right. Oh crap. I kind of want to fight a dire wolf because they're like wolves, just they're dire. Come at me, bruh. <laughs> I like how poorly uh, drawn they are. All right. Um, let's try out our katana again. We can one-shot all of these guys. Watch this shit. <laughs> I love it. And with Cartman, let's just, uh... I haven't really used this curse ability too much yet, so let's do this one again, because I like how he just uh, starts screaming a bunch of random shit. You fucking goddamn dizzy tubes out. Dildo. Whore. Wiener. Christian. Baby boner. <laughs> Not very good. Get it, bro. Ooh. Hmm, that actually does a decent bit of damage. Almost killed Cartman, but you know what? Doesn't matter because it's over. Kick ass. Kick ass. All right, we killed the dire wolves. We can now loot them. Oh, look how funny the cash looks. All right, and let's fight this dire wolf too. And fart on that doggy, and he is taken out. And God. All right, and we'll loot these as well, and take all. Hmm, am I allowed to swim? Cause I see treasure up there. Oh, I turned into a boat. That's so cool. Carmen does too. And a barbarian mullet and maple syrup. Adds 100 frost damage, so that's cool. <laughs> I love this place. Alright, we got a dog to fight, and then I will see you guys in Winnipeg. And uh, just to level up a little bit more, I'm going to fight this dog real quick, and then we're going to Winnipeg. Sorry, guys. Alright, we just defeated the final dogs up here, so we're going to loot them real quick. But first, guys, I did this just to make you guys mad. I wanted to see how mad you get if I didn't go in here right away. Make you guys think I forgot it. Oh, look at this. Wait, wait, wait. C'est la S mauvais. Allo? A secours. Any of these things do anything? Canadian gemstone. <laughs> guys, I am not going to lie. I have no clue how to get past this rock here. I've tried everything possible. So I am going to leave this and maybe come back and hopefully figure it out then. Also, there's something up here. Do I gotta fight these dogs again? Oh my god. They're gonna shit on Cartman and kill him. God damn. They're shitting on me again. Are you kidding me? Alright, let's just take this guy out in one shot here. Perfect. Okay, we. There's also like a spider web thing above me, and I tried to get in there earlier and it wouldn't let me. So, with that said, we are not gonna try to get up there until later, which we might be able to do that, plus break that rock or something. We, we're going to Winnipeg. Let's do it. Welcome to Winnipeg. This is a conservative township, so mind your P's and Q's. Do whatever you want with your T's and M's, however. <laughs> Welcome to the shop. Can I interest you in my wares? Now, does this guy have anything cool? In terms of weapons... No, that's not that great. Weapon strap on... Hmm, I don't use magic too much at all, really. Uh, an attack's more... I don't need these. Anything cool in this place? I guess not. Ooh, what happened over here? You know what Winnipeg is known for? Uh, neither do we. <laughs> they say that two Canadian monks live on a secluded island in the middle of Vancouver. This poor citizen was killed by a dire bear. You know what a dire bear is, right? It's like a bear, but it's dire. Oh this poor God. citizen was killed by a dire bear. You know what a dire bear is, right? It's Sorry, like buddy, but there's dire bears up there. You know Ooh, I'm gonna a fight a dire is, bear. Right? Oh, Sorry, he won't buddy, let me buy. Look at this. Up there. You know what a dire bear is, right? Oh, I can't swim. What about going over here? Nope. Thought that might uh, open some secret entrance in there. What is in here now? Ah, uh, yes. This writing is definitely Canadian. But why should I help a foreigner when Winnipeg is completely overrun with dire bears? Tell you what. Kill off all the dire bears in the north of town, and I'll help you however I can. Looks like we need to fight some dire bears. And this guy will let us by now. Sweet. And if we hit him first, we'll get to attack first. Perfect. That's something I learned way too late into the game. Holy this crap, like there's a lot of them. I'm going to do a speed potion here just so we can take out two in the first turn so that if they are very strong, they won't be able to kill us. Let's use our katana. Oh, this is going to be easy. <laughs> you did. And... Guess what? 
You guessed it. You did. Alright, and Cartman, we are going to be using... Let's do Burning Cloud. I like Burning Cloud. That almost kills them, but at least we get to see what kind of attacks they have. Bear Balls. Ooh, missed the block on one of them. Let's just take him out real quick. Oh, I will. Even though you're on fire and look like you're miserable. I can't see. I can't see. There's a victory thing above me. Help. There he is. Now I can loot him. Okay. I guess we can only loot one at a time. Get anything from these? Ooh, we get some Canadian gems. Now, let's go talk to this guy again. By Jove, you've done it! Look at all these diabare pelts! Now I can finally make a dire rope! It's like a all rope. Right, give me that Just document. this dire. Oh, I thought he was going to say that. Mm, yes. This is actually written in the language of Eastern Canadian. The Minister of Montreal can translate it. But I'm afraid the Prince has imprisoned the Minister of Montreal in the caverns of Quebec. I will speak with the Prince. Return to him, and he should let you speak with the Minister. Boy, oh boy, I will have the most dire robe in all of Canada. All right. Oh, we got a friend request from him. That's cool. So we need to return to the Prince of Canada. There you are. I understand you wish me to release the Minister of Montreal. I'd like to help you, but I think this might be another ploy by the Bishop of Banff to have Montreal allowed back into the kingdom. Some Canadians think our nation should be united again, my lord. <laughs> Shut up! Who the fuck are you? Listen, it's all because the Bishop of Banff is a liberal. He does these things just to make life difficult for me. I must ask you to perform another noble quest. Go to Banff and kill the bishop. <gasps> kill the bishop of Banff? Shh, you, shh. Kill the bishop of Banff for me and bring me his balls as proof. Do this and I shall allow you <laughs> into the catacombs of Quebec. Make haste! Oh my god. I gotta bring his balls back to the prince after I retrieve said balls. So now we need to head up here to Banff. Which will be difficult because there's snakes in the way! Alright, let's see what these snakes have in store for us. You shall not pass! Nah. Um, I'm actually going to just... Oh, this is going to be really easy. Perfect. He's been taken out, and now Cartman, let's take out this one. And we'll use this attack. Why not? God damn, fuck you! Piece of crap, slung! Fuck! Wiener! Hey, you, greasy pierce, stay, stitcher, smegma bather. Smegma bather. Oh. Damn it. Jehovah was actually telling us about what smegma meant the other day, which we all thought was really funny. So uh, I'm really confused because we didn't know it was a thing, but uh, now I'm actually glad I have that knowledge. So thank you, Jehovah, for teaching me about smegma. All right, let's talk to this Banff guy. Have you been to Newfoundland? You won't find better sodomy in all of Canada. <laughs> Is that a beaver? So that was pretty lame, so let's head into this place and do what we need to do. What's this guy say? Banff Canadians are quite religious. Indeed they are. Ooh, treasure. But can I enter that? Hmm, I don't know how to open that door, so we might figure that out later. But let's talk to this good guy. Praise Christ. Pray the prince thinks Canada is a monarchy. But there's other people with opinions by God. Sorry, God. What's this? Who the fuck hits a bishop? Okay, it looks like two attacks we can kill this guy, so I don't even want to see what attacks he has Skip. because we're going to do this real quick. <laughs> God, 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 it. That is good for damage. I like that. Now, let's hit him with another one. Yes, we can do two in a row here. Perfect. And this might actually be enough to kill him. Ass greasing. I hate you. Dizzy tube sock. Fat bitch. Fucking son of a bitch. Shit sculpting. You asshole. Fucking god damn. I hope you fucking elephant walking asshole. Get crazy. Asshole. Get crazy. Get crazy. Oh, almost killed him there. Perfect. You dick. <laughs> he farted on me. Are you kidding me? Get pissed, Cartman. Get pissed. Get pissed. Go for it. Game over. Okay, okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, you don't have to kill me. I'll go away and the prince will never know I'm alive. Please, take these dire pig testicles and tell the prince they're mine. <laughs> Bishop, I'm sorry, man. Ah, yes, awesome work with the bows. You think the prince will let us keep them? <laughs> Alright, we are level 15 now. We have the bishop's balls, which look just like the uh, the pig balls, or whatever I stole them from. Whatever he offered me, I should say, rather. Let's... We can't even increase that anymore. Let's do our horn of irritation. 
Actually, you know what? I like this bull rush attack for having armor. Let's just upgrade that one. What's in here? Dire Scepter. I think that's how you pronounce that. Not that great, but we can sell it for 720. On our way back to the prince. I am really enjoying Canada. This is a lot of fun. I didn't know Canada was actually like this. Like, look, if I ever go to Canada, it's going to be interesting to be in a top-down world. Like, where you can only move like this. So, uh... I might stay away from Canada. It sounds weird to me. Is he dead? Did you kill him? Yay! The bishop's balls! Now religion won't interfere with government. How can we ever repay you? You said you would free the minister of Montreal, my lord. Sorry, no can do. With both the bishop and the minister taken care of, my throne is secure. But my liege, we made a promise. Shh, you. Shh. <laughs> oh my god. Quickly, you must speak with the Duke of Vancouver. He can help you get into the catacombs of Quebec. Give the Duke this. Hurry now. All right, my lady. We are now on our way over to Vancouver, and I will see you guys over there. To Vancouver we go. To Vancouver we go. We got snakes and we got bears and we got dire wolves chasing me on my way. Vancouver. What does this fine lady have to say? Many wonderful films are shot in Vancouver. All of them are about cabins terrorized by serial killers. Yeah, that's probably true, actually. Welcome to Vancouver, the San Diego of Canada. The San Diego of Canada? Oh my. What is over here? What's this guy to say? The Bishop of Banff is dead. What monster could kill such a wonderful man? That weapon's not bad, but it's not good either. I got a better weapon. Hockey is quickly becoming the world's 11th most popular sport. <laughs> oh, I'm showing that to my best friend, Shadow. Ooh, a totem pole down here. See that, guys? I like totem poles. What is the point of this place down here? There's gotta be something. Um, unless I'm dumb, I don't see any point to this building down here. So, uh... I'm probably dumb, because why would they put this down here for no reason? Unless it's just to fuck with you. So let's head on over here again. Hello, sir. They say that the Duke earned his title by winning a log roll with the last Duke. Yes, yes, I know. But Ottawa is clear on the other side of Canada. How are we supposed to get there? Uh-huh. Yes, I see. Oh, wow. No, I didn't know that. Not that yes, good. Come on. And... Yeah, I that guy too. Uh -huh. Hmm, that one no, might actually be good. Did. Barbarian helmet. We'll have to consider putting that on. The barbarian helmet is indeed better, so let's modify that real quick. Can't see it, but I'm sure it looks cool underneath all this crap. A letter from the princess? What the? Why, according to this, the prince had something to do with the bishop's murder and has imprisoned the minister unjustly. Young man, if you wish to brave the catacombs of Quebec, you would have to speak with the monks who live to the southeast of town. Only they could train you in such sorcery. Oh, so that's why I need to go down there. I'm just getting so many Canadian friends. Are you seeing this shit? All right, let's go down and talk to the monks down here. There is a lot to do in Canada. It's like one big wild goose chase. It's Terrence and Phillips. Perhaps he is the American everyone is talking about, Terrence. Nah, it can't be. He can't be a master of spellcraft. He doesn't even know magic. He probably doesn't even know how to fart. What is the sound of one anus farting? Oh, now you know. <laughs> What is the sound of one anus farting? Oh, now you know! Who are you? <laughs> oh, I need a dragon shout on him. Obviously, come on, Speedy. Jesus, you smell. He knows dragon shout. Any magician's apprentice can dragon shout. It's not like he farted into his hand and hit you in the face with it, Philip. Now he wants a cup of spell. Alright. Oh, now you know! <laughs> My god, he can cup a spell! If he's really good, how come he can't sneak a fart behind your fares? <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Oh, wrong thing. Let's do the sneaky squeaker. And we'll hit A to detonate it behind. The sneaky squeaker! Very impressive. He is worthy of our training after all. Yes. Prepare thyself, child. It is time for you to learn some true magic. Am I going to get to learn my fourth fart? They just knocked me out with a fart. What the hell? Your magic is impressive, young American. What? Not since Eric von Thunderpants of Nova Scotia have we seen such prowess. But now, you must learn to control your anus muscles in just the right way to change a spell's frequency. Ooh. Some objects seem too large to be damaged by magic, but now I will break through it with Nagasaki! Nice! Here, watch again. Hold down R. Find that frequency. Up. Oh, I will. 
Hold down, find that frequency right there, and up. Oh. That's it! Now let us see how Nagasaki works in battle! These three pedophiles from Alberta will have their way with you <laughs> unless you damage them all with one move. Nagasaki! And down, and find that frequency, and up. Oh. Beautiful. <laughs> That's it! You have the power! I love my new fart. And don't ever, ever fart on a man's balls. I love how that's a recurring theme. All right, I'm going to add my new perk real quick, and I'll get right back to you guys. Because we now have 55 friends. We need 15 for the next perk. God damn! I'm going to use Marksman here. Your ranged weapon attacks inflict extra damage. That sounds good to me. We now need to head to the catacombs, and we can probably break that block. We can no longer get away from me, Snake. Holy crap, that was close. We can now break that uh thing we couldn't break earlier. Oh, did he battle me? No. Perfect. Objects with flashing green cracks can be destroyed with Nagasaki. With Nagasaki selected, pull down, then push up on R to start the rumbling. Perfect. Let's fart on these guys to get them all grossed out before battle, and let's hit them. Alright, I think I hit them first, because I will die if they all get to attack first. That would be really bad. Come at me, bruh. Perfect. Now, um, I also ate a mana potion uh, off screen there, so now I have full mana, so hopefully I'll have enough. Yes. Hits all targets with a blast of irresistible magic that can blow them away. Hold down R. Move L to find the frequency. Seriously, how sweet it would be if I had a spell sweet. that could make cows suck my balls? Could you imagine? Find the right frequency here. Oh wow, that does a lot. Puts defense down on a lot of them. Cool. Um, now for Cartman, let's try out this one real quick. Actually, let's do a double attack. I don't want to let these guys attack me because if they all attack me, it's going to be a bad time because there's so many of them. So let's do two attacks. And... Let's do this one twice. Oh. Well, I don't think I needed two attacks. <laughs> so waste the potion. Let's loot these guys. And there we go. Let's break this. Get nothing from it. Break that. Also, wait. A pixelated shard. Cool. Nothing from that. Now there's some treasure back here. Barbarian armor. Adds 110 armor, reducing attacks. Sweet. Let's put that on real quick. Okay, now all we need for the Barbarian set is some gloves. Ooh, a gem. I can sell that. Je suis libre! Je suis libre! Oh. N'avez-vous besoin de collections traduites? Okay. C'est la saint traduite par c'est la. C'est la saint traduite par c'est la. Voila! Bonjour! Merci beaucoup! <laughs> Look at all these friend requests I'm getting. This is cool. Bring the translated list to Annie. Sweet. Later, guy. Let's just keep heading south, because that should take us to where we want to go. And let's talk to good old Annie. Ready to go back? Yes, I am. The girls are ready to see you. See, right here it says that five women were at the clinic that day. And right there it says Nancy Turner, 3.30 p.m. That's Heidi's mom! So Heidi Turner was the two-faced bitch! The evidence is irrefutable. Thanks, new kid. We now know it was Heidi Turner all along who was spreading the rumors. You're welcome. Freaking two-faced butt rag! Fuck Heidi Turner and her fucking two-faced ass! But Heidi's really sorry, so we're deciding to forgive her. <laughs> I love you guys so much. We love you too, <laughs> Heidi! Yay! Yay! You serve the girls well, new kid, so you have our services. Tell the boys we will play their game. Sparkle! Oh, I can hang out. Oh my god, look at all these friends. Only three? We should be friends so you can like my posts. I bet you're thinking about something totally deep right now. I sure am. I learned that betrayal can actually make your French. As an honorary girl, you've been granted full access to our adorable supplies. Wanna do a little shopping? Yes. Watch them have like some crazy good weapon. Um, it's saying it's better than what I have, but I kind of like what I have more. It might be better to have armor as opposed to HP, but look at this. I can have fucking fairy princess robes. Let's do it. 
Oh, I hate wasting all my money on this crap. Let's put that on real quick. There's also a shock ram here. I want to see if it's better than what I have. It says it is, but I'm not sure. So I'll take a look real quick. Look at all them friends. There's still more to be had here. I haven't talked to everyone yet. Yeah, actually, it should be better because it's going to hit six enemies at 500 damage, which would... Yeah, so I don't know. I'm going to buy it. Now, for selling, I'm going to sell all my uh, junk and stuff, guys. That didn't give us as much money as I wanted. And we're going to add 100 frost damage on a perfect attack so we can freeze people yet again. Let's talk to the rest of the girls here so we can uh, get a bunch more friend requests. You should totally stay as a girl. It's so much better. You're really different from the other boys. Like, you aren't even gross. Thank you so much for clearing my name. Now when girls call me I a whore, it's more in a joking way. Oops. I almost forgot you're not a girl. What, will you be my friend? God damn it. Oops. Ooh. Jim Pokemon! And, oh my. Armor, headband, Valkyrie gloves. That's 130 armor. Well, I'm just going to wear this now. I don't know why I even wasted all my money on that other crap. What's this do? Adds 80 armor. Okay. And the gloves add 50 armor. I'm going to look at all my stuff here and choose the best one, guys. All right, this Valkyrie headband is better, so I'm going to put that on. Valkyrie armor is actually better than the fairy princess robes I just bought, in my opinion, so I'm actually going to be using that as well. So I just wasted my money on that crap. <laughs> oh, yes. Can we dye this? What if we make it red? Oh, that's cool. I like that. Let's uh, make it red so it stands out a little against the body tone there. And now for gloves. This only does 30 armor. This one does 50. So let's do that. Wonderful. And we can dye these red as well. I think we uh, have done all we need to do here. Now this is the big thing. Where is this going to unleash us at? Because we don't know where the girls are at. So where is this going to take us off to? Will we get to see where they're actually hiding out at? I bet it's someplace really funny. And Come on. Show us. Come on, loading screen. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I knew it. I was watching my recording back for the previous episode. I tried going in there and it wouldn't let me. That is funny. Okay. Let's head back to Kyle's because I'm assuming that's where we need to go. They painted the kitchen this color because Kyle family really likes gold for some reason. <laughs> Everyone listen up. The girls have agreed to fight by our side. You're welcome. Let's the pirates and the Federation factions are standing by to fight as well, my lord. Then the time for talk is over. Let us all make haste to Clytus! Oh my god. Today, we are not elves and humans. Today, we fight as one. What we do here now will be written and sung about on YouTube for days to come. <laughs> Let us besiege the army of darkness with the courage of dragons. Let us delve their dungeon with swords and sorcery. Let us charge our shields and use photon torpedoes to vaporize the Klingons. Kevin, god damn it. <laughs> Every fucking time, Kevin. God fucking damn it, seriously. I'm sorry. Armies of justice, prepare! Ready! Let's Look at David Hasselhoff running with all those kids. Clad, we're coming for you, Clad. Ow! I'm hit! They they tore my costume! I worked really hard on it! You sons of bitches are gonna get what's coming to you! We are your darkest fear. Alright guys. Only a paladin can Next time on South Park Sick of Truth, we will be fighting Clyde. I'll see you guys next time. Leave a like if you enjoyed, and thanks for watching.